Good morning, everybody. I am Russ. This is Chris. It is Wednesday. That's for my dad. I'm going to start saying every day of the week. So he'll know we're on okay. Wednesday. 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 Wacky Wednesday. Wacky Wednesday. Wacky Wednesday. Uh, what is your best trait? Some people are good with this some people are good with this i think my I, I have my own what i feel like is my best trait and i feel like my own best trait is self uh, motivation i can motivate myself i don't need anybody around to help me do anything that doesn't mean i can't that i'm like oh man i can't do the computer because that i don't i don't think that's a like i could i don't i don't what trait what trait affects others go, what what go deeper what good trait of yours affects others? That affects you. Uh, I think my positive attitude, you know, just being, I'm just positive. I don't, I mean, there's, you know, there's things. I just, I just like to stay positive. Now, when you see me, a lot of people like think I'm in a bad mood. If I'm down at the backyard and it's nighttime, I probably am. Because I'm going to be there. You're sleepy. Yeah, I'm going to be home. But I, <clears throat> I wanted to go into the self motivation because maybe that's not a trait. Because of it's the new year, I'm watching all the people put on their going to the gym. I'm watching all the people starting their new diets. I'm watching all the people that don't understand it's a lifestyle change. It's not a two-week process. I wanted to get into it's that. It's not two weeks. No, it's not two weeks. I'm out. And I wanted to get into, well, you did it. You changed the lifestyle. You stopped eating as much. You stopped doing this. You lost the weight. It's proof. It worked. And, you know, in training people and, and talking about it, a lot of people don't understand that it's 90% mental. And it takes some self, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Man, look at that cake. Willpower. Take, willpower. It willpower. Takes, uh, it takes willpower to not whip through Wendy's. To not, to when you go somewhere to ask can that be grilled instead of, yeah. you know, it takes a little effort. Yeah, it, it takes effort. <clears throat> it takes effort. And I was talking to me and Stephanie were talking last night, and I said I was going, I was going, uh, I was going to bash her today, so she knew it was coming. <clears throat> her her last two years were excuses. Everything was an excuse. Everything is. I'm tired from work. No, you're not. You're not tired from work. We you are too. Yeah, yeah. You are tired from. The lack of physical effort your body's used to doing, so now you're mentally tired, which makes you go, I'll just do it tomorrow. I'm just tired. And, and people are like that. And, and people don't understand that the, the energy you get from working out carries over to your job. And, and me and her, and I told her, you know, it was excuse after excuse after excuse after excuse. But husband Russ couldn't say nothing. Trainer Russ did. Got mad. She got mad at me. But until she hit that wall... Yeah. You know. It's no different. Uh, excuses. I hate going to the gym by myself. I hate doing anything by myself. Yeah, I agree. Except grocery store or walking in Dillard or something like that to where it's okay to be by yourself. But other than that, if I go to eat or if I go into the gym, and the gym's okay to be by yourself. Everybody in there is by themselves. Yeah. But I still feel like everybody's looking. Yeah, I, I and can, I, I can only imagine someone who is more out of shape than me and walking in there and feeling that. Yeah, and self it, it, it That's why it goes back to another that. Another deal of willpower. Yeah, and it goes back to that deal of the middle part. And it is, you, you hit the nail on the head. There's a lot of people that feel uncomfortable about being alone. And I, and I mean going in there alone because like you said, what if what if I'm doing it wrong? What if they're looking at me and I'm doing it? And it's but for a hundred bucks, you can do it right at home. Oh. You you can get the bands, you can get a ball, you can get just enough stuff to do it at home, and then you can walk or you can run. You can do it with gallon jugs and a chair. I mean, yeah, you can do it right here. It is your and listen. The reason why I'm on this is because hey, it's hard to do it at home sometimes. Well, just because of the willpower. Yeah, oh, it's easier to lay on this couch. The food is your key, man. And you didn't overtrain to lose 
20 pounds. No. You didn't overtrain, which barely trained at all. But anyway, you didn't. But you changed your eating habits. And when I tell people, when you eat a burger, all this was just hiding under there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was your winter coat. The winter coat. When you, what you put in your mouth is what your body looks like. And it's hard for people to understand, well, I like that. I like Vegas Buffet, but I can't go because I will eat three plates. And it has nothing to do with willpower. I will tell we you. We go to Vegas Buffet. I will eat three plates. I will eat one plate and sit there the whole time going, oh, I wish I had another plate. Look at, the, look at Russell. He's on his third one. I yeah. Didn't want, oh. yeah. And then a lot of times I'll get up and go get me a couple more rolls of sushi. Even though I should have stopped, and I know that I know today's show is just about the New Year's resolution and stuff, but I really want you to focus on it's mental, it's not physical. I hate when people go, "I'm just too tired, I just can't go." I'm just, that's crap. That's crap. You. The biggest thing I see with people is I'll do it in thirty minutes. Yeah, I'll, I'll get up and go to the store here in a second. And, they, or, and, we, and we don't go. Or across the board, and, and I'm gonna use some examples. Gary, let's get that, let's get that around that toilet done. I, I'm gonna get that tomorrow. I'm gonna get on it. While I just stand here today. Yeah. Or uh, kids, hey, let's get that bed made. Uh, I, I'll do it right after breakfast. Yeah, right before I leave school, I'll work, <clears> and then And then, on. oh, I don't, I, I'll get it after school. You know, there's I, so many deals. Get up and do it. I, I, Probably one of my best traits is usually nine out of ten times. Hey, we need to do this. Right, let's do it. Let's do it. Get it over with. Because I don't want to have to deal posters. with it later. Set the posters. They've been there. Now don't say I don't have to be reminded <laughs> once I get home. <clears throat> do you find that as getting older that you do? I do. Do you find it that they getting that I forget that. We, you have a, everybody has a separate life. So after we've talked and you get home or Hoax talked and he's got home or we've talked and I've got home, I don't. Usually, usually no. With everything that's going on right now, I got a lot of yeah outside stuff going on. Not bad, just a lot right, of. Right, right, right. And a lot of planning and, you know, that whole thing. And so I'm scatterbrained a little bit. So... Y'all didn't want to do the Jacob's Ladder in, in three minutes and have Gary to take the picture? Because I'm going to tell you. I pleaded for it. I'm going to tell you. I pleaded. It works exactly the same. I pleaded for it. Okay. Okay. I was giving you that out there. Stay focused, man. I think she thought I meant climb Jacob's Ladder. <laughs> yeah. No, we don't have to climb it to get to the top. Stay focused and know that it's mental. Know that it's mental. You are not tired. We always say set small goals, and that's the key. It takes doing it long enough to get one compliment to make you. So, yeah, I, so, so I'm asking you, that. people that, that are watching that, that want to get in shape, need to get in shape, do it long enough, and when you start going, man, you're losing a little weight. Man, you look, your shoulders, or whatever it is, I, it kind of gives you that, ah. I agree with that, but I... You shouldn't need it. I, but yeah, I agree with that. I agree that the vein of people need to know their work is being... I guess it's really no different than what Hope said the other night. We did our movie and we're getting these compliments from people and we're getting bashed. I'm, I'm glad. People need that in life, though. You know. You do a good job, you want to hear you did a good job. You don't have to, right. to do a good job, but man, it sure makes you feel good to go... And hey, you're doing a dang good job. And be willing to listen to the bad job. Yeah. Because doing the movies <clears throat> and getting the critics on every movie we're doing, people are, are going, that's a piece of crap. That was good. This ain't worth watching. I like watching it. You got to have the same thick skin. Thank you, thank you, thank you is all you got to say. Because you want both. Willpower. This thing. This thing is, the, is a lot of people's problems. Do you agree? Yeah. This thing's a lot of people's problems. They can't get past a lot of stuff. I posted on Facebook today. It's everybody's problem. Because it all starts there. Whether 
I agree. Whether with willpower or just something off the wall, it, it, it starts in your mind. I posted on Facebook today, if you dwell in the past, you're going to have trouble living in the present. Um, and a lot of people dwell on the past. I, I'm one. Yeah. You are. I, I have to take, I have to make a conscious effort to put the past behind. Right. Because like, last I checked, we can't change anything about it. I'm working on that. No. All right. I, you know. We're going to get out of here, man. Have a good day. If you, hey, comment, do whatever. Say something. We don't care. Uh, if it helped you, great. If it didn't, great. I know I have my man bun shirt on, but I have my. Russell's I'm does training out here. hundred an hour. I would do it. You know hundred an hour. Somebody asked me why I don't do it. Somebody asked me why do I not train. I got a full setup in my garage. I train two people. I train two people. And I, well, Stephanie's three, but I'm married to her, so I have to. Two people. And it's only because my buddy Gerald has pretty much said, train me and I'll, I'll get all the equipment for you. So that's a bonus for me. But if we wasn't making movies, I would train. I would, I would own a gym and I would train. But for two reasons. But it's time, yeah. You like talking. I like talking. You like telling this person how to better themselves. Correct. I like to see the results. Yeah. You 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 do a good job of that. Well, yeah. Well, I appreciate it. Sometimes we want you to shut the hell up. Yeah. But the good is in there. Is I gotta get you to believe it. I swear to God, if you'll do it, I gotta get you. I to was told it. this just the other day. You know what? You make your point in one sentence, but you say sixteen, and mine might be sixty-five. And I went, you ready? I said, I'm just trying to find a perfect analogy. Yeah. So I just keep throwing them at you. That is exactly right. So after the first one, when you get it, just say, I got it. And yeah. I'm only going to give you probably three or four more. Yeah. I said, that is, that is really good. Whoever said that was, that's really good. That's really good. I like that. All right, we're going to get out of here, man. Remember, watch it, like it, share it. Big shout out to Isaac Martinez, though, who had us over at the shack last night. We did a podcast. Uh, his page is... It's just Isaac Martinez. On I Facebook. shared it on mine. Yeah. Y'all, y'all can find it. I was leery about going. I know it's hard to believe because it was 7.30. It was at night. I was leery about going. Like, man, I don't want to do this. Got there. Had a really good time. I made the same comment. It was one of those deals that I didn't want to go, but once I got there, I was fine. And, and it was a good time. I enjoyed it. I Shout really out. enjoyed it. Thank you, Isaac. All right, man. Until tomorrow, I am Russ. This is Chris. Lunch specials right here. We forgot to talk about Chicken it. Chicken fried steak. Bam. Probably shouldn't go with this uh, topic today. Today, if you go, cut it in half, share it with a friend, eat half a plate piece. Or, Take if you home. got your little skinny friend, let them eat the chicken fried steak. Ah. And you can eat the, the Chris's uh, grilled chicken special. That is true. Just say Chris's grilled chicken special. That That's going to be on the menu next time. But uh, do not ever ask for the Big Daddy Russ. Uh, grilled, grilled. No, that was good. I got, that's grilled. Yeah, it's I grilled. thought I was going with my with avocado, oh. which is good for you. And a fried egg. Fried that's egg, good. and maybe yeah, get the egg. Go ahead. Until tomorrow, I am Russ. This is Chris. We are out.